join up to the strike force. Hi, it's Jeff Vaughan and Joe Dawes, assistant coaches of the Adelaide Strikers with you again. Um, we're at our last training session before we head to, to Melbourne and take on Shane Warne's Melbourne Stars in the KFC T20 Big Bash here at Prince Alpha College. Um, wonderful morning. Um, Joey, what have the boys got planned and what have we got prepared for today's session? Uh, we've got a little uh, game, in the, in the squad game, into a trial match between the boys. Got a few guys from the Redbacks in to, to help make up the numbers and you know, I've not been here before, it's a great place and looking forward to a good game. Great facilities here and uh, we've obviously had a, a bit of a break after our last game. We had two two games in three days, bit of travel, play, travel, play. Five days off, what have the boys been up to? Tell our uh, wonderful supporters what the boys have been doing the last little break. Well, we, got a few, we snuck a few days off, but the boys had club cricket on the weekend, so they got two days of club cricket. Uh, if those that didn't play club cricket, we had a training session on Sunday, so... They've been busy, been able to sort of wind down a little bit, but still busy. A um, bit of gym work with Riggsy and then back into it today. The boys had, uh, had some good performances in grade cricket on the weekend. We're going into our last pool game against Shane Warne's Melbourne Stars. Yep. Tell our wonderful supporters what we need to do to uh, to ensure we get a place in the semi-finals. Well, we've, you know, we've done the numbers and we have to uh, score 27 more runs than they do if we if we bat first and then if we bat second we're going to chase them down in 16.5 uh, overs so the beauty is we know what we have to do there's no sort of other variations can creep in over that and if we go out there and execute our game plan and whack warning over the fence a couple of times we're we're off to Perth for a semi-final and when we have played well we've had big wins in that vicinity yeah absolutely obviously we give the renegades a good touch up and went up to Brisbane and give the heat a bit of a touch up which was quite pleasing for some of us so uh, all around you know when we put it together we're a good cricket team and you know it's been our downfall we probably haven't put it together as much as we'd like so if we string all three disciplines together tomorrow night we're off to Perth I think we've got too many drums. Support for the Blue Army has been fantastic 27 28,000 people at Adelaide Oval you've experienced it for the first time tell us your thoughts. Uh, it was brilliant great fun great atmosphere you know I know from from us as staff and, and the players thoroughly uh, appreciate the support they've been getting from the Blue Army and you know I had two nieces down that were part of the uh, Guard of Honour the other day they had a great time getting out on the field with the fireworks and everything so it really is a great night out and you know again from ours we really appreciate it so lovely to have Adelaide behind us in such numbers. We have had some wonderful support and hopefully we can put on another really good performance in Melbourne. Uh, I'm sure we'll be having a lot of supporters watching it on TV and hopefully we can go through to the semi-final and the final stage. Once again thank you very much for your support. Yeah.